I'm Harm and I'm here with Eliza and we're from Reese High School and we'll be interviewing local musician Clinton. Let's go have a chat. Clinton, can you tell me a bit more about what you do? Yeah, I'm basically, I'm a musician. Uh, I play all over the state and occasionally interstate. Um, my main job, I guess, is uh, doing functions for people. So people will ring up and hire even myself um, or one of my other bands that I'm in. And uh, that's what we do. We go and provide <laughs> entertainment for the masses. So that's my main source of uh, income. What's your favourite part about being a professional musician? Uh, my favourite part is I actually, <laughs> I get to play my guitar, I get to sing, and a lot of the time I get to sing songs that I want to sing, <laughs> and I get paid to do it. What are some of the opportunities of the industry that some people might not realise? If you put yourself out there, and make yourself available, make yourself known, um, there's opportunities everywhere, from little luncheon gigs, to corporate gigs, to, to yeah, from all clubs and sporting events, it's, there's quite a lot of work out there and uh, I guess you've just got to be available to do it. So what got you interested in being in the music industry in the first place? I always loved music, but it wasn't until I got to about grade 9, grade 10 at school that I realised some of my friends were very good at, at music and I wanted to tag along as well. Uh, and I started to probably dream then that yeah I wouldn't mind getting in a band and, and making a go of this. It's I'm realising the dream I suppose. I get to do what I want to do. It's my passion. Who is suited to something like this? I believe if anybody's got some some ability and passion for for music, but more importantly for, for performing for someone wanting to get into the music industry, what pathways should they take? I believe the first step you need to take is get, get as good or the best you can at your chosen instrument, whether it's singing or playing guitar or playing piano or even playing multiple instruments. You need to get yourself out there as often as you can. Um, you can't be picking and choosy when you're starting off. You've got to do gigs that sometimes might not be suited to you, but it's all about learning and getting used to performing in multiple and different environments. Um, I'd also encourage people to become entrepreneurs. So you have to be an accountant, you have to be <laughs> able to travel yourself and book your own things. Um, and if you get in a band and you work with other people, then you've got to be very good at relationships because that is probably the hardest thing that keeps talented bands together or not. What other skills are important to have as a musician? If you can, um, you do need to have a sense of humour, I believe, uh, and don't be so serious, because that, I believe, is a, is a big no-no for a lot of musicians. They take it so, everything so much to heart, um, you're gonna get a lot of your knockdowns, but if you can be um, resilient and take your good times with your, you know, with your bad times, you'll enjoy what you do. So that's a big skill, I think. Um, You've also, you've got to be good at performing in your instrument of choice. And those that make good choices, I believe, are the ones that have success eventually. Thanks, Clinton. Today's been great to get an insight into the music industry. Hopefully it gives students an idea of what to expect and the opportunities. 